What is up, Tadpoles, and welcome to week six, right? Week six? Of the APDL. <laughs> yeah, week six. Today, we are facing up against the Sin City Spartans, uh, coached by my guy, Big Mac Zach. Um, he's got a team of Obama Snow, Butterfree G-Max, Cinderace, Decidueye, Frostlass, Hippowdon, Morgrim, Registeel, Ronin Pete, Suicune, and Tentacruel. Before we go on, we got the Yoda shirt. You are do not. There is no try. Mm -hmm. We got, got Yoda on the back, you know. Sock of the day. We got Yoda, baby Yoda. <laughs> Y'all know how it is. Alright, let's get into it. Strengths of his team. He's got good support with Morgrim, got fake out, screen, sucker punch, things like that. And then Butterfree with compound eyes, it gets 97% 97% accurate sleep powder. Uh, it also has rage powder, which is really annoying. I don't really have any grass types that are good on my team, so I can't really ignore that. Then also with Suicune, he's got Snarl, Tailwind, Icy Wind, um, which is really annoying for my team since Colossal and Guzzlord and uh, Togekiss are all special attackers. Um, yeah, and then he also has Weather Control with Obama Snow and Powdon. He's brought a, he's brought Obama Snow a bunch of times. I don't know if he's gonna bring it this week, but if he does, I'm for sure bringing Cole. <laughs> then he also has a lot of Pokemon with Hippowdon, Suicune, and Registeel. And Registeel can literally like three v one me if he gets it set up with Iron Defense and Amnesia uh, to set up uh, Defense and Special Defense respectively. So on paper, um, I was thinking Togekiss looks like a really good matchup just so I can redirect and. Um, and eat some hits. Um, also, Helping Hand is really nice. Colossal obviously looks really good. I gotta bring it even on paper if I don't bring it in game. And Azumarill looks really good because Cinderace can change type. It usually carries like Dark, Fighting, uh, Fire, and uh, what else? Uh, Protect maybe, I guess. But yeah. And um, obviously, we want that Aqua Jet into Colossal, which is really nice. Uh, then I think he's gonna bring Suicune just because it's a good angster to Colossal. Butterfree is nice for that sleep powder, obviously, and Morgan has that fake out in the screens, as I said, and he pretty much always brings Cinderace. It's probably his best hard hitter, so yeah. Then we got the niche Pokemon. I was saying maybe bring Virzion, maybe bring Sneasel with that because of Rage Powder and stuff like that, but I don't think I'm gonna bring Cold Game 1, so we'll see about that. Guzzler looks good here because Special Guzzler kind of hits him really hard with. Max Dragon to lower attack, Max Darkness to lower speed death, and Heat Wave is really good, especially against his Ice types. Though I don't think he'll bring them, um, he does have Decidueye, Obama Snow, and Frostlass, and uh, yeah. Emolga, not looking good here, uh, obviously because I want to go Trick Room and Emolga's fast, so that doesn't really work. And uh, Belossum, not really good here either because of the fire types, and same thing with uh, Galvantula. So let's go to the team builder, and check out the team. Alright, we're back. So, we got Life Orb Colossal, Bluey, the G-Max Colossal, with Protect, Heat Wave, Solar Beam, and Meteor Beam. I don't need Max Ground in this matchup. Um, Solar Beam is to hit Suicune, Heat Wave is to hit uh, just everything, basically. <laughs> and Meteor Beam is to obviously set up that Hulk list with that chip damage is really, really nice. I have enough uh, speed to outspeed plus one Cinderace, um, and the rest into uh, Bulk, and that allows me to run a Modest Nature, which is really, really nice. And uh, Life Orb is here just because he has Snarl and I could just haze it away if, if that if the opportunity presents itself. Um, then we got Eggy, the uh, Azumarill with uh, Citrus Berry. We got Aqua Jet, Protect, Player Off, and Iron Tail. I'm not running Steel Roller here because I don't think I'm going to set up Terrain, but yeah. Um, don't think he's going to be a Maximon here. He's just uh, probably like a, a sweeper in the back, quote unquote. With Sap Zipper, I can take hits from Obama Snow. I basically wall Obama Snow, actually. I don't think it gets any other good uh, special moves. It gets Ice, which is not very effective, and it gets, and obviously Sap Zipper allows me to eat up those grass attacks, so that's really good. If he does bring the Sidui, also nice. Uh, just max HP, max attack, you guys know what it is, for defense for that uh, Cinderace. Then we got the Beery Berry Togekiss. This, uh, this spread allows me to survive a, I think, plus one Steel Spike um, with the Beery Berry. Follow me, Protect Helping Hand, and Air Slash. Serene Grace gives me that 60% chance to flinch. And then we got uh, 132. I think I put the rest into this for death, and then just 4 and 4. Um, yeah. Then we got Mama Smurf. Standard set, max HP, max attack, adamant nature. Actually, uh, brave nature. I'm running 0 speed, so uh, the plan is actually to just set up Trick Room with the uh, Dust Crops, fake out Trick Room, and then spam Last Resort until it dies. We got Silk Scarf to make Last Resort and fake out even more powerful, and yeah. Then we got Gimme Gimme. <laughs> the. Uh, does collapse with Nightshade, Haze, Trick Room, and Brick Break. Brick Break is here because I'm actually running uh, Weakness Policy Guzzlord here, and uh, Brick Break also because he has screens, and that's really, really annoying for my team, but if I use Brick Break, bam, they're gone. Uh, also, I have Haze here because if he does get up, get Registeel set up, it's really, really a big problem, so I could just Haze away all those stats, bam, it's gone. Then we got, last but not least, um, oh yeah, this is for, I don't remember, this is for it to live a Max Darkness from, from Cinderace, yeah, but uh, yeah. 
Then we got um, Wormhole, the <laughs> Guzzlord with Weakness Policy, Dark Pulse, Draco Meteor, Heat Wave, Protect, just max HP, max Special Attack, and for Defense. So, with that said, let's go to the battlefield. Okay, we're back. Okay. Always a little nervous. Um, I practiced a lot, so hopefully we're good. He does bring the Tentacruel. Okay. Uh, he does bring the Tentacruel. No Obama Snow, as expected. He does bring the Frostlass. Um, no Registeel, which is really good, actually. Uh, and Rotom Heat. Rotom Heat. Okay. So, what can I do here? I think the... the hmm. Could go uh, Peggy right here. That could be good. And then just, like, spin. Hmm. Or I could go Wormhole. That could be good. No, I think I'll, I think I'll still go with Setup Trick Room. Because I, I still beat him in Trick Room. So I'm going to do that. Alright, so we got Mama Smurf. Gimme Gimme. <laughs> so, yeah. Kangaskhan, Dusclops, and then uh, I think Eggy and Wormhole in the bag. People are watching. Alright. It's a bread, it's a prince. Oh wait, good luck, have fun. Ooh, almost forgot. <laughs> Too nervous, too nervous. Nice, nice, nice. Um, do I want to bring Colossal? Hmm. Questions, questions that must be answered. Uh, I feel like since he has two water types, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Wormhole. Yeah. Cinderace and Morgan. That's fine. That's totally fine. I should be faster than him. Risk Life Orb, Evil Light. Okay, perfect. Good to know. Good to know. So I will fake out you and Trick Room. Let's see why I don't do that. Um, yeah, hopefully I'm faster with Kangaskhan actually, because that would be bad if I'm if I'm not. I am running zero speed. And then again, I don't think he's running speed on Morgan. Okay, good. Okay, good. Okay, good. He flinches. Good. Good. Nani? Cinderace with taunt. Nani? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. That's not good at all. Um. It was at this moment that he knew. Yo. <laughs> That's hilarious. Cinderace with Taunt. I don't even know what gets Taunt, but that's funny. Okay, uh, what can I do here? What can I do here? So, I'm obviously gonna last resort you, and then I could switch in the... No, I'm a Nightshade. Oh, it does Dynamax. Okay, okay. That's fine. Reflect. Steel Spike. Interesting, interesting. Steel Spike here. It's gonna do nothing. Yeah, resisted. Oh. Okay, night shade. Should have brick break. Okay. Um, I'm gonna last resort you and brick break you. Sucker punch. All right, as expected, he does sucker punch. I don't have pain split, so this is really annoying. Oof. Brick break. Nice, super effective. <laughs> okay, taunt ended. Now what? He is steel spiking. So what do I do here? Hmm. The good thing is that my Guzzlord is special, so it doesn't really, like, help him. I think I'm gonna sack Dusclops to get free switching. Looks like, Steel Spike. Alright, that's fine. Okay, um, he does waste his Dynamax though, so I'm pretty comfortable here, actually. Do I bring in Eggy, or do I bring in Wormhole? I think I'm bringing Wormhole. Wormhole. <laughs> Hilarious name. Okay, uh... Hmm. Do I Flare or do I Worm Wind? I think I Worm Wind. Yeah, I'm gonna Worm Wind. It's pretty safe. This is the Guzzlord's last stand. Because I actually switched him. I, I made some trades this week. So what does he do? Light screen. Interesting. Iron Head. Whoa, that's that's an interesting move. I don't know why he would do that. Um, resisted, that's fine. I'm gonna take out you and darkness. Right? Sucker punch, that's fine. Scorching sands. Oh, he's special? What? He is special. I'm so confused. I get a double KO. That's nice. Um, I'm so confused. What? Cinderace. Okay. Last resort. Uh, probably. Yeah, I'm gonna go into Tentacruel and Max 
Darkness, the Sweeper. No, I think I'm gonna double the Tentacle. Because that's the biggest threat. Bulldoze. <gasps> Weakness policy, Tentacruel? Yo, that's some tech. That is some tech. That isn't Gleam. Oh my god. Yeah, but I'm Weakness policy. <sighs> Ooh, good thing I, I targeted the Tentacruel. <laughs> Dead. No, it didn't die. Oh my god, clear body. <sighs> this is not good. It's not good at all. Oof. Okay. What can I do here? Uh. I can Aqua Jet or Iron Tail. Play Rough is not very effective. Iron Tail is not very effective. Oh, this is a close game. Dang. Iron Tail. I'm gonna protect. Wow. Oh, he does protect. Okay. I protect, he protects. Scald. Ice Beam. Okay. That's not good. Um. Oof. This is really not good. What do I do here? The weakness policy tentacle. It's probably like super bulky. Because the uh, tentacle's got like 120 spadef. Okay, um, do I go for the double protect? Not good at all. Yo. I'm gonna go for the double. Oh, I failed! Air slash. Doesn't mean. No! Eggy, baby. Don't miss. Oh my god, this isn't even KO. Ugh. I'm an Aqua Jet. I'm not huge power. Oh, okay, I do take the amount. Okay. Air slash. That sucks. Okay, um, I'm gonna play rough. This is not good. Don't flinch me. Don't! Oh no! It flinched! 30% chance! No! I lost. Don't! Oh, the double flinch! Wow, okay. Uh, yeah, rip. GG. <laughs> That's game one. Okay, uh, I do not feel good about this. Hmm. Okay. Let's uh, challenge him again. Okay, what do I do game two? What do I do game two? Because he has taunt. So I can do follow me, honestly. Um, or do I just go call? Ah! No! Honestly, this, this was a hard matchup because he has like all these weird mods. I don't even know Tentacle gets Dazzling Gleam. That's crazy. Hmm. Probably has double taunt. That would make sense. What can I do? What can I do? I go cold. I think I'm gonna go cold. Double protect. Um, and then bird in the back. With Mama Smith. Yeah, I think I like that. Ugh. Cinderace Morgan. Okay. I'm gonna double protect right now. I don't see why I don't. Protect. Protect. He maxes. Probably gonna max uh, ground. Because he is special. Fake out. Yep, was expected. Quick. Hmm. Do I Aqua Jet and waste my Dynamax? Or do I leave Cole as a sack, is the question. I'm gonna go for a starfall and I'm gonna switch into burb. Screw it. Cause I'm not I'm not watching the I'm not um not weak this boss, but yeah. Okay. Light screen, feel spike, oof, do I live? Oh god, okay good, I live. Uh so not good. Bam. I am not watching my colleague though. I'm not huge power though, so kind of weak. I feel like I can protect again. Yeah. Sounds good. Reflect. I steal spike. Yep, I eat that. Yeah, that was a good move by me. Because he can't KO my Eggy, but get rid of that. Get rid of his Dynamax. And now I can X Geyser U. Helping hand. Sucker Punch, resisted, get out of here. Iron Head, I live, we're good. Geyser. Oh my god, that literally does nothing. And now I have like uh, Aqua Jets that I can do. Aqua Jet. 
to take. Oh, it doesn't KO, oh my god. So gross. This doll is real. No, I'm gonna protect. Hmm. Need to make some switches. I'm too stubborn to not switch. Really bad. It's like really late to realize that, but yeah. See, now he switches. Great. Iron head me. Great, great. Um, what do I even do here? Play rescue. Iron tail. Aqua jet. You could tail in right here, that'd be bad. I'm big on this weekend. Oh my god, that literally does nothing. Now I'm dead. Oh, I lost! Oh my god, that does so much in the rain. Alright, I'm bringing in the bird. Protect. Last resort. No, I lost. It's very bad. Follow me. Heat wave. Oh no. Oh my god, I just threw. What could I have done better? That's the question. Should I have Cinderace? The Cinderace just always beat me. GG. Ugh. I'm just bad at this game. <laughs> no. Such a hard matchup. Stupid Suicune is so bulky. It doesn't even die to a, a max grass from uh, from which you call. He didn't even bring Butterfree, which is probably what I was worried about the most. But Cinderace just destroys me when it gets a boost and then it, it just like changes type. And I, I don't know. In all my mocks, I just lost to this thing. All right, let's cut to the interview. All right, what's up, Zach? Hey, how we doing? We're good. We're good. I just I just lost. Stupid Cinderace was my old team. <laughs> Yo, what is this Cinderace set though? I was not expecting Tom. That that totally screwed me up. Tom, dude. It's, it, I, I knew it would. I don't have a lot of good Tom or Trick Room coverage. I found that out against Max Watts. Um, I lose instantly to Trick Room. Um, right. So we had to switch that up. Mm -hmm. Yo, inter interesting uh, tentacle spread. I originally, honestly, like until five minutes before a battle, I had Ice Beam instead of Dazzling Gleam, and then I remembered he had Guzzle. I didn't even I know like, he oh, gets like, Dazzling Gleam. I totally forgot. <laughs> I didn't think you. Yeah, yeah, true. I, I didn't think you would bring Frost Ice, but you didn't, so it makes sense. No yeah. taunt on uh, Morgan totally threw me off. I was like, okay, this is this thing's gonna taunt me. I didn't know Cinderace gets taunt. I was totally screwed. Yeah, uh, Cinderace is actually a really good support Pokemon if you use correctly. It gets True. ally switch. It gets ally switch um, and coaching. Yeah, so it, it's kind of nifty. Kind of nifty. Yo, that max special attack. <laughs> <laughs> it's so weird. It's base 65, so it's kind of trash, but like, it paid off for you, I guess. So yeah, like I said, if you can get it up, up pretty good. I mean, I think, if I remember correctly, it's base that after being... Like naive and max special attack. I think it's like base 119 special attack after that. So wow, that's crazy. Ah, not bad. <laughs> not bad at all. Sucker punch, fake out, light screen, reflect with EV light. Nice. Just like bulky spread. I figured you weren't running any speed, so yeah. I, I knew uh, Kangaskhan was faster anyway. Even though I was running zero speed on Kangaskhan, yeah, zero speed. The last resort just just does so much damage. I was running, yeah. I was running Sap Zipper, honestly, but like it didn't pay off because you didn't bring a bonus note, and I guess I should have hard read that and just gone huge power because then it would be doing All double right. damage. <laughs> no, that's fair. Yeah, I don't think I should have maxed it because like it's, it didn't do enough damage. But I was running um weakness policy Guzzlord and uh, Life Orb Colossal this week. Okay. Yeah, and Blavir... you see, I was I was hesitant with the Colossal. I, I always just expect weakness policy because that's the right standard. Yeah. yeah. It's uh, honestly like, it's it's a nice strategy to have, but in reality, um, it's very hard to use in draft. <laughs> I hate it. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm, I'm in another league with James. It's a restricted league. For yeah. BDP. And last season I had uh, Colossal Dmax and Primarina. Right. And I only brought Cole three times, and mm -hmm. it didn't get a single kill. 
Right, so, so the problem with my team is that I don't have any other real modes, so I made I made a bunch of switches, so next week you'll see the switches. <laughs> yeah, I, see, I think that's where I, I messed up this, this league. I, I, because I, I really do think I'm a, a good player, I just think I got an awful team, I accept that. <laughs> but, I, I, I think I'm a good player, I just think I got my my trade, my transaction way too early. Yeah. I didn't think next people were going to start switch, like dropping Venusaur and Torkoal. I'm like, yeah, bro. Yeah, people drop Venusaur and Torkoal. <laughs> I was like, dang. Dang, man. Yo, honestly though, if you got um, if you got Reggie Steel set up, it walls my whole team. See, I looked at that too. I just <laughs> it destroys I me. It. That's why I brought Haze. Yeah, I was like, that's oh, fair. Yeah. Man, that would have made me sad. Yeah. So I'm, I'm glad I didn't. But... All right, so GG to you. Thanks for thanks for coming on. Always appreciated. Yeah, so uh, yeah, yeah. If you guys work, if you guys like the video, please like subscribe. You guys know what to do. And uh, with that, bye. <laughs> Say bye, Zach. Deuces. Deuces.